Well, it's a new day and we put the Evo 9 front dual canards with the blocks on hold. So today we're gonna continue. But if you guys haven't watched my last video, you should definitely go and check it out. Anyways, let's go and hop back to this guy. So I'm gonna go pull that out and then I'm gonna set up over here, drop my tables like usual and get started. All right, let's do it. So, this is where we are currently at, but so far I have the block. I have all this. It's pretty good at the bottom. I'm gonna fix this. That doesn't look good actually now that I see it in the light. I'd like it to cover that. But for the most part, that is the design that I'm going with. It looks pretty good under here. This line is pretty much perfect. Just this one right here. As you can see, it's actually just the lip that sucks because it's all sucked in and obviously the paint starts all the way over there. So it's covering all the paint. It's just the lip sucks balls. So this is actually good. Never mind. I don't want to do that because if I do, that might jack up everything. So I got all that. Now I need to build the dual canards and then this project's done after I duplicate everything and make a set with it. Then I'll have templates for anybody else to order it. But until it's done, you're just gonna have to keep watching. 12 seconds later. All right, so we got super lucky and I happened to find this template that just happens to be pretty damn close to exactly what I'm going for. See that gap from above? Now that is pretty spot on, except it's short. I'm gonna make another one, extend it, and that's gonna be my main template, I hope. Fingers crossed, let's get to work. Alright, so so far we do have the template ready for the upper canard. I still need to do the bottom one, but the upper is huge progress. So I already got the gap. If you can see it, it is super tight. There's literally no gap except for maybe on the corner and the front where I didn't fill it perfectly. But this is just a template, which is all why it's all funky shaped or whatnot. But that is exactly what I'm going for. I'm probably going to curve this to complement this from above. You see how... A different angle from the lip and that would look really good complemented like this let me try to me try to do that right now definitely the angle i'm going for which means this hole needs to be here all right cool that's definitely going to the final design hell yeah oh that looks good yep line complementing each other beautiful anyways we're gonna do this. I'm gonna realign the holes because this is just a template. I like the holes to be as even as possible. And then we are gonna do the bottom. So let's keep going. On the plus side, it looks like this template is almost perfect. So gotta love that.
boom son there we got it guys look the bottom is complete this is just the template i need to design the fin but for the most part that's everything that's hard to do about this entire project i got the bottom i got this edge perfect up in here i got the top i got where all the l brackets are going to be sitting in place for securing it i'm going to be doing the base a little bit different so the hardware looks a little bit more squared away sorry guys military term but yeah so everything's done gonna go make the legit fins and finish up this build well we still have a lot of time to go in this build but we are looking really good we just need to finish it duplicate and we're done two hours later alexa off my bad as per usual. Jesus, Alexa. Bruh. Alexa, off. Off. Oh, you mother F. All right, sorry. As per usual, I am once again working at night because it's stinking winter time, and that's just how it works around here. So I am almost done. I'm final designing my canards. If you can see it. Sorry, guys. I only have one light. That is my next project for the garage because... It sucks working over here and you guys can't see so that would be so much more legit if we just had a light there anyways yeah I'm making the final design uh, he asked for it to not be so aggressive so I'm gonna shorten my normal width by an inch so this looks about good and we're about to kill it with this project so let's get to cutting I finally have everything drawn out. He asked for a simpler design, so I'm trying to deliver that. It's still pretty out of control. It is pretty wide. This is one of my toned down designs. It's definitely not as wide because my normal one would be this wide, which is pretty out of control, but hey, a lot smaller. The front's still big, but I mean, this makes it look good. This line that I'm about to cut out is perfect. From above, you could see, boom. I do need to trim this one just a little bit because they're not perfectly aligned. As you can see, boom, and then it'll be good. 3.28 a.m. All right, so we are finally done with the dual canards. I didn't make the final product, but I did manage to finish like everything other than duplicating. I can do that tomorrow. I just really wanted to get done with the main product. So, let me show you guys what I came up with. So, as you guys saw earlier, the setup I had was a little wide, and then I read over the message that my customer wanted, and he said that he wanted these sides to not stick out so much because, you know, his car is not wide. So, I was looking at it, and it just looked way too big. So, I actually shortened it another inch. So, now, as it lines up, you can see, that blue tape is two inches of a splitter sticking out. So now everything's lined up. That right there is the dual Ube made with bumper block, Evo 9 spec front bumper canards. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below because your opinion matters because you could be my next customer. Nah, just kidding. But yeah, just let me know what you guys think. I think it turned out great. Looks awesome. And uh, I mean, I couldn't be happier with the product. The blocks turned out great. Everything turned out great, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not subscribed yet, you know, show me some support. Subscribe if you guys really like this video. Just hit that notification bell if you wanna keep seeing my content. I'm gonna keep busting these things out. I mean, it's just me getting down in my garage, so, you know, they're gonna keep coming. Uh, I'm having fun editing the videos for you guys. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.